Um, I got something new I want to share with you guys. This is the uh, Star Trek The Next Generation uh, Klingon Attack Cruiser. Um, this is pretty cool. This Ron, this Klingon ship. This is from Star Trek The Next Generation. And it, uh, it's got the dual light up engines, four authentic Klingon attack cruiser sounds, cloaking, disruptor cannon, hit shields, and phaser. Highly detailed replica of the Klingon attack cruiser. Bonus technical blueprint included. Includes actual sounds from Star Trek, the television series. And this is the Star Trek The Next Generation edition. Let me show you the back of the box. Star Trek The Next Generation Klingon Attack Cruiser. I don't know if you guys can see that. I'll put pictures up so you can see. Um, Klingon Attack Cruiser, one of the most powerful warships in the galaxy. Um, it shows you different details of the ship, the control bridge, the disruptor, ray disruptor, um, the light engines, and terminal on Klingon Attack Cruiser. The Klingon Empire is famed for its highly developed warships and warrior mentality. The Klingon Attack Cruiser is the most feared of them all. It is also the most advanced ship in the Klingon fleet, graded as a Vorcha class attack cruiser. This warship measures in at nearly three-fourths of the length of the Federation's Galaxy class starships, often used for transporting ambassadors and Klingon high-ranking officers. The Vorcha class cruiser is deemed the flagship of the Klingon Empire. Its forward mountain disruptor cannon is one of the most advanced and destructive weapons in the known universe of the 21st century, uh, 24th century, excuse me. Fortunately, this weapon will not be turned on the Federation and its allies, thanks to the peace treaty signed between the Klingons and the Federation. The unique design of the Vorcha class attack cruiser allows the forward disruptor cannon to be jettisoned, thus increasing the vessel's overall performance and speed capabilities. And it shows you the other different things that's available. Romulan Warbird, and I have that. I'll make a, another video another time with the Warbird. But um, this is pretty cool. Uh, this is from Playmates again. And let me go ahead and take it out of the box for you guys. Okay, so I've gone ahead and taken out of the box for you. And um, this particular piece does not have a display stand. But you can see the detail is pretty cool on this. And show you. I'm going to put some pictures up and you guys can pause the video to check it out. Um, really highly detailed. On the bottom you can see where the speaker is for the sound. Let me go ahead and show you guys what it does. Whatever, if it's in the screen, right? <laughs> It's got four buttons on top. It's, cool. it's got four buttons for four different sounds. I don't think this part lights up. Let me check. Nope. The only parts that light up are the, the nacelle type pieces the um, engine propulsion. I'll put some more pictures up, but this is pretty cool, the Klingon attack cruiser. Um, again, highly detailed from Star Trek, the motion picture, uh, excuse me, Star Trek, the next generation. Let me put it here for you guys to look at. And I'll put some photographs up as I go along. And see where you guys can display see the display of the lights and all the sounds. And again, this is from Playmates um, for Star Trek The Next Generation. And this is the Klingon Attack Cruiser. I uh, hope you enjoyed checking this out. And until next time, I'll see you guys later.